And welcome back. And uh, this is Hacienda Iguana at Colorado's Beach for the Nicaragua ISA World Masters Surfing Championship. And uh, that there was Javier Wakea of Peru and uh, doing a little bit of hand surfing there and uh, indicating he knows exactly why he got 6.33. And that's a very happy team there. Great looking board he has yep. underneath his uh, feet there, Rocky. So uh, a great celebration there. Let's take a look uh, shortly at the highlights from today's action and look at Wakea. He is absolutely stoked. Uh, as they come up here. We are down here at the Beach Club, and this is Robbie Page who started off this morning. Yeah, he had a couple of nice vertical turns there. Advanced through this heat, but unfortunately wasn't able to advance through his next heat. So Robbie Page is out, but a great story and a great interview uh, that he provided for us. Yeah, it was. This is Herberto Romeros of Mexico. Put in a couple of strong performances to make both of his repertoire rounds. And the right here, this man was very polished. Hiroki Watanabe, with turns like that, was able to move through quite easily both of his heats, still alive for Team Japan. And uh, then we moved on to the Grand Masters, and uh, there we see the celebrations, as they mm -hmm. should, because he Watanabe surfed incredibly well. But then Juan Ashton, he was on form today. Yeah, and this is your all-time uh, medal leader for the ISA World Games, and he proved why he is on top right there. Magu De La Rosa, and uh, he was definitely one of the best surfers of the day. Yeah, the Peruvian uh, got busy really early on in the heat. He held to it all the way through the heat, start to finish, did really well. And then this man was eliminated, but he had some really great surfing in the early round. Uh, very much like Aki, his favorite surfer. This is a Tahitian Pascal Luciani. Yeah, Pascal surfing really well. And... Uh, this is Craig Shiba, the man from Costa Rica, who continued through both the Kahunas and the Grand Kahunas. Yeah, and uh, did a great job getting his board loose, getting his body loose on the rights, on the lefts, always uh, performing well. Well, this is Ronald Reyes, oh. and this is one of the best waves of the day. Yeah, and one of the best ones of the contest. He just got his fins free on all three of those turns, greeted by his daughter, the Venezuelan, did... Uh, just put on a great show. Uh, this is Herman Aguirre, and uh, this was a display of fantastically smooth backhand surfing. Yeah, he's, uh, I believe, a uh, surfer from... Uh, I think it might be Peru, Peru as well. Peru as well, yeah. He was, uh, or maybe Argentina. But uh, we'll get that stat uh, yes, right. correct. But this is Juan Ashton from Puerto Rico, unmistakably uh, the champion of the ISA and proving why he is so with this wave here. Got plenty of scores above the six and seven point range and uh, made it look uh, fairly easy out there with these uh, turns he's doing and pulling in on the shore <laughs> break. Yeah, full on commitment. Then it was Santiago de Pache of uh, Argentina and uh, this man really went for it as well. Yeah, Chris turns there, just beautiful surfing, nice finish. And uh, here is Javier Huaracaya who we just saw win that last heat. And with turns like that, with selecting waves like that, he's going to keep winning. Yeah, it was a good day for Peru as well. An incredible day of competition down here at Colorado's in Nicaragua. 